Rosemary Noble, editor of the Victorian Artist Society 150th anniversary book. What a terrific job. How did it go? Oh, thank you, Ron. Yes, it was um, a labour of love, I'd have to say. There, it was, there was a lot of work in it, but it was um, a, fa a fabulous way of getting to know the members of the society better and really um, delving into our archives to find out all sorts of interesting pieces. So I think it's um, we've, we've picked out a, a good range of lovely little stories. I hope everyone will really enjoy it. Well, one could say that you had the biggest canvas, painting canvas, stemming from the original painters like Roberts and Streeton and those guys up to our marvellous painters of today. Yes, I know. It was, it, it was when the, the more I delved into it, the more um, exciting it was to, because I've never um, known half of these um, artists were involved in it until quite recently. So looking at the archives and then reading all of those minutes from 100 years ago, it was, it was a real joy to find out what, we, what was going on in, in this society in those days. And it also tells the, the story of the various ages of the society when it starts and all they had was a little room at the back where they used to hold the smoke nights and then it goes on to how they developed up the galleries, etc. Yeah, I love the, the, the little uh, old prints of the tiny little blue stone building that was the original, that, uh, which is now um, forms the studio at the back of the building. And uh, just imagining all of those, our, that all of our famous alumni like McCubbin and Roberts and Withers and all of those people um, in that in that um, studio, you can almost see the paint, the paint on the easels down in there. But then there's the the, the lovely sections of the book of our painters of today, uh, where you've got you know our, some of our leading painters, and you've got all of the people who were the president of the society. Uh, that is just a, a gathering of stuff that people have never seen before. Yeah, uh, apart from those stories, we wanted it to be a good record of the history of the society. So um, while we went through the decades gone, um, it w w I thought it was important, or well, the committee um, thought it was important to um, really try and showcase the work of our current members. And we've got such a lovely variety of paintings oh, on all sorts of media. Um, in this, within this book, and so I think it it's, it gives it a much wider appeal and just showcases what a wonderful group of people we've got in our society. And isn't it a, a gateway for young artists joining the society? What a wonderful book to have to be able to give to new members of the society, and they can read and see the history, and they'll get a real feel. I, th I hope they will. I think um, uh, once you start looking into it, you think. Well, wow, what a, what a great variety of, of different art styles. There's quite traditional, there's really contemporary, there's some fantastic range of, of artists in there. So I think it appeals to anyone who's got any interest in art to, um, to look at what was and what, what is now. Basically, this book sets the, the, the next 150 years. Uh, to this year is the celebration, and it is a book, obviously, uh, because we're now having a search for all of the relatives and all of the descendants of, of the members of the Artist Society, and so this book would be an ideal thing for them. Yes, I hope we, we've tried to contact as many of them as we can. Um, we've we've um, gone through our our own lists of um, contact people and tried to include any relatives of, of our past members and so on. So, um, and I think there's something in there that they would absolutely cherish. I, I hope so anyway. Well, Rosemary, the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to ask you to hold up the book for <laughs> us as the editor of this marvellous, uh, marvellous book. And uh, it really is a, a fantastic result for the society and all of our members. 
and we thank you and all the other people who are involved very, very much for creating this wonderful publication. Oh, thank you, Ron. I think, I think it's... Um, I'm, I'm really appreciated the help I've received from all of our current, current members and all of the contributors to the book. It's been a wonderful little adventure for me and for them, I hope. Thank you very much.